Hello again. It's Wednesday, April 20th, 2022. This is Journal TV, and I'm Jerry Clark. It's time for the news. West Rock's Covington Mill will begin a planned maintenance outage the morning of April 23rd. Work will be done in the woodyard May 9th through 10th. The paper machines will be down at various times throughout this outage for maintenance. There's much more about all this right now on AlleghenyJournal.com. The Allegheny County School Board held a relatively brief session on Tuesday evening, the vast majority of which consisted of honoring the system's various teachers of the year, as well as sports standouts. Successful FCCLA recent competitors were recognized. Some CMS students gave the audience demonstrations of an upcoming musical, and the Lewis Gale Allegheny Regional Hospital was named to the VSBA Business Honor Roll. Clifton Forge Town Manager Chuck Unruh and Public Works Director Chris Kieser took time out to speak to the Journal on a very cool Tuesday about the A Street Water and Sewer Line project now underway. The multi-hundred thousand dollar project will result in two lines being constructed under the Jackson River, which will serve Verd Street, Mound Street, and surrounding areas. There's much more about all this right now on AlleghenyJournal.com. And now a word from our sponsor. There's a reason why Leah Fisher Janos was recently named Roanoke Region School Librarian of the Year. Apparently, boundless energy. The Sharon Elementary School Librarian recently remarked that when she heard of the honor, quote, I felt like Miss America, as far as a librarian can. Read much more about all this right now on AlleghenyJournal.com. Three Clifton Middle School history students were named the top trio in the Elks Americanism essay contest. First place winner was Ellen Heck, second place winner was Izzy Spangler, and taking the third slot was Ashlyn Brookman. Now for local obituaries. Edna Diedrich, 79 of Fairfield, died Saturday. James Lawhorn Sr., 73 of Lexington, died Friday. Thomas Clater, 78, formerly of Lexington, passed away on Thursday. Charles Bradley, 91 of Covington, died on Monday. More information on all obituaries may be found on AlleghenyJournal.com. Let's check out the local weather forecast. On Thursday, it should be partly cloudy, high of 72 and low of 53. On Friday, partly cloudy, high of 80 and a low of 57. And on Saturday, mostly sunny, high of 83 and a low of 60 degrees. And that's the way it is on Wednesday, April 20th, 2022. More stories, photos, videos, and interviews are available 24-7, 365 on AlleghenyJournal.com, YouTube, and on our soaring Facebook page. Thanks very much for watching Journal TV.